Opening statements today in a case here in Pittsburgh that could have national and international implications. Should the McDonald's Corporation be held liable for the rape of a 14 year old girl in one of its franchise restaurants? Today in court, McDonald's asked for the case to be thrown out. KDKA investigator Andy Sheehan was first to report this story. Andy. McDonald's USA says it is not responsible for what happens in its franchises, but the family of this 14-year-old girl says they should be held liable for her rape. The family of the 14-year-old girl filed suit against McDonald's USA and its franchisee, Rice Enterprises, which operates six McDonald's restaurants in the Pittsburgh region. The suit alleges both are responsible for the actions of the defendant, 42-year-old Walter Garner, who pled guilty to raping the girl in the bathroom of one of their restaurants. Garner had been hired as manager even though he had served time for indecent assault of a 10-year-old girl in 2003. But in court today, McDonald's USA argued the case against it should be dismissed, saying it's not liable for the management decisions and actions of its franchisees and saying there is no way the corporation could know of or foresee the actions of this manager. But the girl's attorney, Alan Pear, said McDonald's mandates could control of its restaurants down to the amount of ketchup it puts on its hamburgers and is responsible for providing a safe environment for its workers. The case has national and international implications since 92 percent of McDonald's 38,000 restaurants are franchises. This is McDonald's global values, the McDonald's global system. Uh, you don't have to worry if you send your daughter to go to work at a McDonald's in Timbuktu. It's going to be the same McDonald's as you get in Pittsburgh, and, and you don't have to worry about her being abused or attacked or any her safety at these stores. But then when something happens at these stores, oh, don't don't look to us. Go look go look to some franchisee in Timbuktu uh, for responsibility. It's hypocritical. Now, the attorney for McDonald's USA had no comment leaving the courtroom. Judge Christine Ward said she will rule on this motion to dismiss at a later time. Reporting live downtown, Andy Sheehan, KDK News.